It was a crazy quilt, nutty game. That, I mean, so many things happened in that game, it's a wonder any of us survived it. I forgot how many times we turned the ball over to them. We gave them the ball in field position, you know, early on, it's a wonder we didn't get blown out. We finally get back to the Super Bowl, two years after the disaster, and we can't do anything. I was shocked to look at the stats and see that Dallas had no sacks because they knocked the stuffings out of our quarterbacks. We didn't block them well. They whipped us up front. All the stuff that an offensive line is supposed to do, we did not do. It's embarrassing. Ah, you got to get a hit in and then out, Tommy. You can't stay there. Up there, come on. They're both there. You got to hit and come. I did. I was too late. You can't do the job against somebody else. Looking for a spark, the Colts turned to one of the many trick plays that had served them well during the season. Not this time. Gives off to Haverlack. It's going to be the flea flicker. It is complete to Eddie Hinton. He's at the 15, the 10. Fumble. It goes into the end zone, but who is going to recover him? And what happens? That ball was chased all the way through the end zone by both teams. And it is going to be brought back through the touchback, man. You get a fumble here, a fumble there, and put our backs against the door, and somebody had to step up and stop people from scoring. We had defensively become accustomed to that. It wasn't nothing new. So we knew we had to play exceptional to win the game. 